Hey everyone, my name is Amy Nguyen and I'm a product manager on Visual Studio working on GitHub Copilot. Today, I'm super excited to share how you can build an app from scratch using GitHub Copilot. And the best part? With Copilot's latest features, this process is easier and faster than ever. You'll be so surprised by how long this takes me. The two key features I'll be showing you today are the new vision capabilities and Copilot edits. These features bring Copilot even closer to being your ultimate AI-powered coding assistant. And some even better news, GitHub Copilot now has a free plan. That means you can try out Copilot, including these amazing new features at no cost to you. If you haven't used Copilot yet, now is the perfect time to see how it can transform your development workflow. Today, you'll come along with me to create a Blazor to-do app from scratch, and I'll show you exactly how Copilot can help you along the way. So first, I'm going to create a new project in Visual Studio, and what I want to use today is the Blazor web app template. So looking at these project templates here, I'm going to choose Blazor web app, and yeah. And I'm going to name it like Amy to do one. And one thing to note is that I am using .NET 8, which is the long-term support version. Okay, so now that the template has loaded, I'm going to poke around here and see which pages have been created already. It looks like a counter page has been created, so I'm just going to take a look and maybe just build this just to see what it looks like. Um, since the counter page already exists, I'm just going to modify this page into a to-do app so we don't have to do any of the routing. And I also kind of want to show you guys how Copilot edits can make making edits in existing files so much easier. So we're going to redo the entire counter page. So now that it's built, I'm um, just going to take a look. Looks like everything's working, so that's perfect. So one feature that we're going to be using today that's super helpful in creating this to-do app is Copilot edits. I don't know about you guys, but the hardest part for me of any project really is just getting started. And that's why I love using Copilot edits because it just breaks tasks down in a way that feels so much more manageable and makes getting started less overwhelming. I can just describe what I want to do and Copilot will generate a structured list of edits for me. So, as you can see, in the top right-hand corner, I can enter the Copilot's flow. I'm going to ask Copilot, can you update the counter page into an interactive to-do app set up like this? And what I'm doing here is I'm going to upload an image of the to-do app because while I can just describe to Copilot all of the functionality I would want to do, it's just so much easier to upload an image of what I'm looking for and have Copilot take care of the rest. With the combined power of Vision and Copilot edits, Copilot will process my prompt and image and implement it for me. So let's see how Copilot turns this into actual code. Also, I can't express enough how much using Vision and Copilot edits together feels like literal magic. Copilot now understands this request and outlines the changes it will make in my project right here in the chat window. This step-by-step -step breakdown helps me understand exactly what Copilot is doing and the steps I need to know about creating the to-do list app. So I get a little bit of education in here too. In the code editor, Copilot edits is propagating all of these changes into the file. So now I'm just going to tap to accept each of the changes that it's made. I love how Copilot Edits has made it super easy to iterate through all of these changes one by one so I know exactly what I'm adding to my code. So this all looks good, so I'm just going to tab to accept each of the code suggestions, and I think this makes it super easy for me to know exactly what's going into my code. Another reason I wanted to use the counter application is because I wanted to demonstrate to you all that Copilot Edits makes it super easy to make sure that you know what you're removing and what you're adding. Turning this counter page into a to-do application means I have to make sure that Copilot removes all of the existing counter information and replace it with the new to-do app functionality. So once I've gone through all of this and taken a look at it, I can build it. Perfect. So I'm just going to press hot reload and build it again. Nice, it looks like the to-do UI is updated, so I'm just going to test it out and add a few items to make sure that it works. So I need to go to the grocery store. I need to go to the laundromat. I need to do the dishes. And I need to call my mom. 
works perfectly as intended and now I want to test out the delete functionality and it seems like it works perfectly. In just under five minutes, I was able to create a to-do application using Visual Studio and GitHub Copilot. These features are game changers, making Copilot not just a coding assistant, but a true development partner. Copilot Edits is available starting Visual Studio version 1713, and Vision is available starting 1714 Preview 2. And remember, GitHub Copilot now has a free plan, so you can try these features out today. For more information, take a look at the description below to get started. Thank you so much for creating with me today, and let me know in the comments what would you like to see GitHub Copilot do next. I can't wait to hear your ideas, and thank you so much for watching.